TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. We reached the closing bell on Friday of a pretty wild week. We got the S&Ps. We pull back slightly into the close there. We're going to close basically flat on the session. Uh, we are flat as we speak. You got the S&Ps right now. Flat to the tick at 5,098. NASDAQ 100, slightly red at 68 points in the red, about a third of percent in the red. Dow finishes the session positive by about 50 points, 39,173. The Russell, positive by three at 2018. Bitcoin, we were talking to our man Robert from Kansas City about Bitcoin. Bitcoin, down about $1,000, 51,780. Crude pulls back as well, right? Crude, down more than $2 from yesterday's high, 76.59. Gold catches a little bit of a bid, quite the acceleration from the lows of the early morning at 4.30 a.m. Eastern Time of 2025. You're trading right now at 2,046. You're above 2,050 briefly. Jump to notes and bonds. Got a little bit of higher price, lower yield. We're sitting at four and a quarter percent as we come into Friday. Next Fed meeting, March 20th. As I was saying, though, showing during that last program, right? You're talking about June is really the first projection where things are going to be close to about a 50-50 right now, where the market thinks that they will have enough information to go for that possible cut we will find out uh continuing that conversation on bitcoin because it was an interesting one i'm sure we're thinking about it all of us uh this article just popped up on cnbc okay i think i was searching for it so maybe it find me now this one is dated in january okay but it talks about some of those fees and it actually brings up the etf we were talking about with robert bito that has a nine tenths percent fee and these new bitcoin ETFs. ETFs are all much lower. And check out some of these. Now, I'm not familiar with any of them, folks. I don't own any of them, okay? But you see the fee ratios. And what they also state here, which is what I mentioned to Robert, is that um, they're foregoing a lot of these fees in the early stages. I think they had it from here before. Now, what they also talk about here, okay, is Bido right here is at 0.95%, and they talk about GBTC, which is at 2%, okay? And GBTC is cutting their fee, but only to 1.5%, and here's the kicker. They know that people don't want to sell because they don't want to incur the tax losses by selling GBTC and locking in their profits just to save on fees. So GBTC says, we're not gonna let you out. We're gonna keep it at 1.5%. Nonetheless, folks, markets almost near record territory. Thanks so much for tuning in. Have a great weekend. Have a safe weekend, folks. We'll see you back here Monday morning at 9 o'clock. Have a great one, everybody.